Big swing face! Sample this. Hi, it's Randy from Big Swing Face. Today we're going to take a look at using controller messages and key switching to create a realistic performance using the Big Swing Face tenor trombone. What you're looking at here in this MIDI window is two different tracks. In blue, the notes of the first trombone part, and below in dark gray are the key switching messages. As I trigger these messages, you will see the lights on the interface change. For example, when I push that B note, you get staccato. If I hold this C, you see a slide takes place. Here on C sharp, a short fall, D sharp, a long fall, etc. The reason these messages are on a separate track is this allows me to go back and add these messages after the fact to create uh, detail in the part that I probably couldn't do with my hands. It would take a lot of rehearsal to try to strike the right keys at just the right moment, and from time to time that's possible, but with a busy part that might be difficult. So what I do is I play the notes first and then go back and add the messages. Let's listen to trombone part one here by itself, and we can watch the interface change and hear the sound change as well. This is an example of using the key switching to select all those articulations within a few seconds. I've also used a MIDI controller, um, controller number 31, which controls the speed of the fall, the long fall. And you will see uh, on the track that is used for that, which is 1C here, you will see this pink block here. This pink block is indicating high speed fall as fast as the knob all the way to the right. And then as we get to the end, right before the end of the piece, this drops down to zero for the slowest fall for the last note. So, uh, and of course you could, you could be much more careful with that and have different speeds of falls, but in this case I wanted a fast one and a slow one. So the, that MIDI controller message will control the knob, this knob here, long fall speed. Putting all that together with the rhythm section and four different trombone parts, we'll get a nice uh, uh, salsa arrangement here. So here you go, the whole thing put together with articulations. So thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.